Hello friends, welcome again to Verified. So, let me discuss on the issue pertaining derivatives. Even if you don't intend to immigrate with your derivatives, maybe your child or your spouse, you must include them in your DV lottery application. That is mandatory. Even if you don't intend to move with them, regardless of the reason, be it financial reasons or any other reason, you have to add them in your DV lottery application. You have no choice. You can't apply as single if you have a spouse simply because you don't intend to relocate with them because of financial problems. No. Even if you are not to immigrate with any of your derivatives, you have to include them in your application. You cannot say that I will apply as single and then relocate to the United States and then later on come for them. That cannot happen. If you select you are single yet you are married and you have kids, that is an automatic disqualification from receiving your diversity visa. Even if you get selected, you will not get your visa because you lied that you are single and yet you have derivatives. The point to clear out here is this. It has not to worry you about leaving your children or your spouse behind. Even if you apply as married or you have children, it does not mean that you will have to relocate with them. It does not mean that. Because in the form DS-260, you will have a place to select whether you are intending to relocate with them or you are not. So you apply in accordance with your status. If you're married, you say married. If you have kids, you say you have kids. And then during filling the DS-260, if you don't want to relocate with either of them, you will select not immigrating with them, but you still have them in the form. So you will relocate alone and leave them behind. Don't make that mistake of leaving your derivatives out. I hope the point is clear. And if it's so, please like the video and subscribe to the channel. And let's meet in the next video.